Obituaries are sponsored by Colonial Funeral Home and Stokes Chapel, Fair, Ray, and Perry Spencer Funeral Homes, Boone and Cook Funeral Home and Crematory. Four announcements from Fair Funeral Home. John T. Tommy Simpson died March 26th. Visitation is tomorrow at 1 at Emmanuel Baptist Church, Oxford, Florida, with funeral services at 2. Visitation will also be held Saturday at 1030 at Ridgeview Memorial Gardens in Eden, with graveside services at 11. He graduated from Moorhead High School in 1969 and from Appalachian State University in 1973. He worked 31 years for Duke Energy in Eden, retiring in 2010. He worked part-time for the Village's Golf and Tennis Division at Havana Country Club. He moved to that area seven years ago. He was an active member of Emmanuel Baptist Church in Oxford, Florida, and served as a deacon and member of the audiovisual team. While living in Eden, he was a member of Providence Baptist Church in Stoneville. Surviving are his wife of 46 years, Kay Shroud Simpson, and their non-biological children, Candace and Sean Mahoney, and Alia Mahoney of Panama City Beach, and Aaron Mahoney of Colorado Springs, and one great-grandchild. Also surviving are friends Jeff and Sherry Barker and Charles and Rhonda Johnson. Funeral services for Beverly Alice Cochran Mitchell, 76, will be held Saturday at 2. The family will receive visitors one hour prior to the service. She was born in Draper and graduated from Moorhead High School. After marrying in 1962, she made her home wherever her family was located. In North Carolina, New York, Tennessee, South Carolina, Illinois, and most recently, Texas. She was a Girl Scout leader, taught vacation Bible school, sang in the church choir, volunteered at her children's schools, and was an Avon representative and studied to be a nurse's aide. Survivors, children, Ann Mitchell Frances and of Lake Forest, Illinois, Susan Mitchell of Myrtle Beach, and Joseph Mitchell and wife Denise of Round Rock, Texas. Five grandchildren, sister Eleanor Cochran Hyler of Eden, brothers Virgil Alexander Al Cochran Jr. and Melinda of Boiling Springs Lake, and John Wallace Cochran and Carla of Martinsville. Memorial services for Jennifer Lynn Brazil Mitchell will be held Saturday at 2. Arrangements for Linda Super, 71, are incomplete. Memorial services for John Marvin Hawks III are today at 2 at Shining Light Baptist Church. The family will receive friends one hour prior to the service. Ray Funeral Home is serving the family. Two announcements from Colonial Funeral Home. Funeral services for Natalie Tinker Annette Barnes Wood are today at 1 with interment in Amos Cemetery. Graveside services for Archie Lee Tucker Sr. of Madison are today at 2 at Palestine United Methodist Church Cemetery. The family will receive friends following the service at Tucker's Farm. He was born in Rockingham County, was a lifelong tobacco farmer, and served the community of Huntsville and western Rockingham County as an active member of the Huntsville Volunteer Fire Department for 45 years, serving as a charter member and chief. He was preceded in death by his first wife and the mother of his children, Marilyn Joyce Tucker one grandchild and sister, Margaret T. Powell and Jack. Survivors include wife, Joanne Cardwell Williams Tucker, sons, Steve Tucker and Epi, David Tucker and Beverly, Eddie Tucker and Lori, Mike Tucker and Mila, Lee Tucker Jr. and Kathy, Mark Tucker and Rhonda, and Jay Tucker and Julie. Fourteen grandchildren, four step-grandchildren, 21 great-grandchildren, and 8 step-great-grandchildren. In lieu of flowers, 
memorial contributions may be made to Hospice of Rockingham County or the Huntsville Volunteer Fire Department. Private funeral services for Alma Lee Mitchell of Walnut Cove will be live streamed today at 2. This announcement from Perry Spencer Funeral Home in Madison. 